celebrating the legendary work of a true musical master, Tribe of the Red Horse. Bringing the warmth, the depth, the power of Neil Young and Crazy Horse, Tribe of the Red Horse. Well, Tribe of the Red Horse was really a way to celebrate the music of Neil Young without being a caricature of Neil Young. It's important for us to portray his music respectfully, uh, but also realistically and faithfully. And uh, we feel we're doing a really good job of that. He came dancing across the water. Capturing the magic of a musical time and faithfully recreating the feelings again for you, live. I played with hundreds of different kind of bands, from funk to rock to punk back in the day. Even had the wardrobe to, to prove all those, but of all the bands, this is the most fun. I always tell people this is the most fun per note of any band I've ever worked. Like Neil Young and Crazy Horse, that era, they had uh, really great harmonies and that it, uh, it's really important for us to try to duplicate that as best as we can and to do the music justice, and I believe we do that with this band. When we're playing and we look out at the audience, it's, it's the greatest feeling seeing such pleasure on people's faces as they're listening. You know, they, it just comes through and uh, just makes me feel wonderful inside to, to be a part of this. We're all really fortunate to have really wonderful human beings in this band. We get along really well, and and uh, it's rare to have that. Uh, and I think that that kind of emulates maybe what Neil and Crazy Horse have, that kind of uh, brotherly relationship. And I think that comes out in the music and the joy we have on stage. And, and I think the audiences can sense that. Tribe of the Red Horse, happening on a club, theater, or festival stage near you. For more information, go to tribeofthedredhorse.com.